Welcome back to a random video. This time we're going to be playing the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Now, I've played this game one time to test it out, see some things how this game's working. It's a very trippy game. So I look uh, I look forward to seeing what this, this one has in store. This is the story of a man named Stanley. Okay. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on a keyboard. Sounds Orders like hell. came to him through a monitor on his desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day of every month of every year. How has and he not gone bald yet? considered it soul renting, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in, as though he had been made exactly for this job. And Stanley well, you know what they say. was happy. Do what you love and you'll never work a day in your life. And then one day, something very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Stanley. Something he would never quite forget. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. No one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Never in all his years at the company had this happened, this complete isolation. Something was very clearly wrong. Shocked, frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. Okay. All right, looks like we're in control now. Uh, all right, buy meanings, let me, I can't even speak. <laughs> buy meaningless, soul crushing job. I'll never press those keys again. Where are we going now? All of his co-workers were gone. What could it be? All of them? Stanley Even the guy back here? Oh, yeah. The meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. There's only a pencil no sharpener. how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. Hello? Hello? Co-workers? Co-workers? Stanley went around touching every little thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference, nor did it advance the story in any way. <laughs> um... Anything outside? No. Apparently, I have died and gone to heaven. Hello? Maybe this is hell. Hello? Anybody in there? Okay, okay. What's this one? What's this one? I can't read none of this shit. It's a cool-looking picture of a leaf. That's that's wet. Hello? Hello, my co-workers. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. If I was a sheep. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. There's Perhaps nobody he here. To stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. No, there's nobody here. The meeting has must have been cancelled. Ah, yes, truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour after all, just to spend a few moments here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. Stanley simply stood here, drinking it all in. <laughs> Drink it all in. Can I? Can I have a soda? Can I have a cold drinks, please? Yes, really, really worth it being here in the room. A room so utterly captivating that even though all your co-workers have mysteriously vanished, here you sit looking at these chairs and some paintings. Really worth it. Okay, all right. Stanley took the first open door on his left. All right, go into, into the, the, the room that he's telling me to go into. Or go into that room. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, Mr. Narrator, I'll be your I'll be your sheep for now. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Or since nobody's here, I can explore. Alright, where am I going? But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. So now, in order to get back, he needed to go, um, uh, 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 from here, it's, um, left. Is that, like, the only way I can go, though? Can I not open any other door? Okay. 
All right, I guess we're going into oh, this no. one. Oh. No, it's to the right, my mistake. You, you are the narrator of the story. How are you making mistakes? No, no, what the no, fuck? No, not the right. Why would I have ever said it was to the right? What was I thinking? It's clearly... Oh dear, would you hold on for a minute, please? I, I... See, we went down right, left, down, left, right. Yep, yep, okay, okay, yes. I've got it now. This story is absolutely, definitely this way. That doesn't look creepy at all. Oh God. Oh God, red light. Dude, red light never means anything good. What the f where no, am I? No, 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 no. This isn't right at all. You're not supposed to be here yet. This is all a spoiler. Quick, Stanley, close your eyes. I will not. Okay, okay, okay. Just Somebody got fired. Back to, um, oh. Who am I kidding? It's all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. How about rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, we'll just restart the game from the beginning. No, this no, time, this is like a... we don't wander so far off track. Hmm? Somebody okay. else got fired. From the top. What the? All right. Cool. We're, 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 I thought I'd never going to be here again. If I come back one more time, I'm going to go bald. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? I already know they're gone. Decided to go I'm in to heaven meeting. or something. Perhaps look at look at the windows. The memo. A meeting, you say? Who left this open? That's dangerous. When static Wait. Wait. What? No. I no, I restarted. I swear I definitely restarted the game over. Completely fresh. Everything should be Oh, did something change? Stanley. My will to live? We were back in that room with all the monitors. Did you move the story somewhere or a Hold on. Well, How was I gonna do that? I'm the one who wrote the story. Exactly. It was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. Okay then, it's an adventure. Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. <laughs> okay. All right. It's an adventure. Can I can I adventure this way though? No. Okay. I'll go this way. This way. Ooh. Okay. 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 What's back here though? A little random chair. That's the chair that we use for timeout. When you're being a bad employee, we put you in timeout. I'll say it. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you there definitely was a story here before. Do we just do we need to restart the game again? No, 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 no. We don't we do not need to restart again. By starting over and over again. We don't need to restart again. No, no, okay, we don't. Give it a shot. No, not? no, 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 no. Okay, fucking. God fucking damn it, I'm back in here again. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? It means nothing. Decided to they go all got the fired. Meeting. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. I don't read memos. Now okay, there's no yeah, doors. I might be remembering this wrong. It's possible the story is back where we just came from. Why don't we go back the other direction and see if we missed anything? Oh, okay. I feel like I'm on an acid trip right now. Aha! I knew we'd miss something. Was it this picture? The story. Here it comes. Wait, this isn't this is not where I came from. What the fuck? No, wait, never mind. Not the story. Okay, let's head back the other way and uh, uh, retrace our steps. Again? Seriously? Alright, I went around this way. Ooh, that's a different room. Where am I? Now this Well, I'll be honest, I don't recognize this place at all. Is this the story? I don't think so. I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place in an office building. It is that correct? Hmm. Do you remember, Stanley? Well, we were. What? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? You win! <laughs> okay. <laughs> I beat the game. I know you put MLG in Gamer. Work, and it really paid off. So, good job. Put me in the game, coach. Put me in the game. Oh, no. no, I don't feel right about this at all. No, don't we take this win away from me. Any actual work for that win? Some people win fair and square, and this was not one of those situations. What do you mean? I didn't do okay. anything wrong. I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I don't care what might happen this time. I have to restart. No, 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 you... All right, I've got a solution. This time, to make sure we don't get lost, <laughs> I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Oh, Just God. Just the line. How simple is that? Oh, God, I'm such a bad gamer. I need assistance. Okay, let's follow the Stanley Parable adventure line. This isn't, this is not where, this, I've never been down here. 
Okay, I mean, let me go down here and see how it. Okay. You see? That, that means nothing. The line knows where the story is. It's over in this direction. The line doesn't want me to step on that trash. The the, here's a thought. Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there? You or need to stop. Another way, you need to stop. It's a story of no destination, still a story. Simply by the How am I supposed to walk on the fucking wall? I think what we need right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. No, I don't need any music because it's probably copyrighted. What? What's wrong with this line? Okay. We have to follow the adventure line. Strictly follow the adventure line. What the hell? What am I doing? Oh my god, red light. Red light means death. What is this place? Where have you brought me? What, what, what was that? I think I came this way. No, no, no. I came, I came from that way. So I gotta go down this way. Where am I? Oh, okay, I can't walk on the walls. So I guess I'll just go this way. Wait, cut the music. Go back and look at that fern. I wasn't, I wasn't, I already looked at Stanley, it. Stanley, this fern will be very important later in the story. Make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully. You won't want to miss anything. All right, and I'm studying the urn, the fern, the fern, the urn, the fern, the fern, the fern. I'm studying the fern. Hmm. Okay, that's it. I'm okay. I'm done studying it. Wait, but we're back at the office. No, no, no. Line. I thought the you line was supposed to prevent Stanley this. Parable, right? Is any of this ringing a bell? No. Not really. I uh, followed the line that you told me to follow, and now it seems like we're both lost. Hey, I'm back oh, in the room you don't want me to be no, at. No, not again, line. How could you have done this to us? And after we trusted you, after still only two people fired. Through, you? No, oh, I can't take this anymore. To hell with it. Restart. No. <laughs> I think we could both. I, I think we both know this line doesn't work. But okay, I'll follow it again. You know what, Stanley? Dude. I'd say forget the adventure line. What's it ever done for us? We're intelligent people, right? Why can't we make up our own story? Something exciting, daring, mysterious. Ooh, Can I fight a dragon? Perfectly doable. Why don't we simply start wandering in? Well, I don't know. How about this direction? What this direction? What's down this direction? Is there a now, dragon down yes. there? This is exciting. Just me and Stanley forging a new path, a new story. Well, it could be anything. What do you want our story to be? I want to fight a dragon. Wild. Use your imagination. I just Whatever want to fight a dragon. Be, Stanley, I'm ready for it. Give me a fucking dragon to fight. Oh, no, not you again. Stanley, I'd also like to veto the line from having any role in our awesome new story. No lines or monitor rooms. Just don't acknowledge it. We should be fine. Okay. Line, you do not control me. You do not guide me. You do not know me. Here. Ah, a choice. We get to make a decision. From okay. here, the story is in our control. How important we mustn't squander the opportunity. In fact, I believe I need a minute to think here. Just walk in circles for a minute. Okay. okay. So I know that each door has to lead somewhere. Which means that somewhere, the place where we're trying to go, there must be a reverse door that leads here. And that, in turn, means that our destination corresponds with a counter-inverted reverse You're door. You're making origin. my head so hurt. Starting, come, Stanley. Our destiny awaits. Why well, am I done walking in circles now? What is this? What's this? Hmm. Hmm. The confusion the ending. Confusion ending. You're telling me... That's what this is. It's all one giant ending. And we're supposed to restart the game what, eight, eight times? What do you mean restart eight That's times? Really Wait, how many times have we restarted game? already? Are you going to restart again? So now, according to the schedule, I restart again. Then what? Am I just supposed to forget? I won't restart the game. I won't do it. I won't do it. I won't do it. Okay, all right, cool. I won't, I won't let you. Oh, my God. What's the board? What's going on? What is going on? What is going on? Did we do it? Did we break the cycle? The, um, whatever it is that made this schedule? How would we even know? What? Well, what was that? Us. Was that a dragon? Did something happen? I suppose in some way that this is a kind of story. Wouldn't you agree? It's a very boring story, sure but sure. The destination or the journey. 
though they're always saying that life is about the journey and not the destination. So I hope that's where we are right now. We'll find out, won't we? Eventually. Well, in the meantime, if you- What the f- <laughs> okay, okay, I'm back in here. I'm back in here once again in this dead end job. What are, All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Wait, did you actually forget? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Wait, Perhaps did you actually forget? The memo. Bro, the narrator forgot. Oh God, I thought I had finally made a friend. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. You, you know what, just because you were cool last time, I will follow your instructions. Following the instructions. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. I have a boss? Stanley stepped into the broom closet, but there was nothing here, so he turned around and got back on track. Okay, I'll get back on track, because I'm a sheep. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's oh office. Oh my god, it looks like something terrifying is down there. Okay. <gasps> Maybe there's a dragon. Maybe there's a dragon down here. Hello, dragon? Are you down here? But Stanley just couldn't do it. He considered the possibility of facing his boss, admitting he had left his post during work hours. Yo, somebody left their lights on over here. And in such a competitive economy, why had he taken that risk? All because he believed everyone had vanished. His boss would think he was crazy. And then something occurred to Stanley. Maybe Did I like the old narrator so first? I wanted to go I on adventures? Crazy. None of it made any logical sense. None of this and makes sense at this, all. That's the same car. Dead. For example, why couldn't he see his feet when he looked down? Why did doors Wait, I didn't even notice that. behind him wherever he went? And for that matter, these rooms were starting to look pretty familiar. Were they simply repeating? No, Stanley said to himself, this is all too strange. This can't be this, real. This is definitely the same car again. This feels like a dream. fucked up dream. That's the same car. I'm definitely crazy. Oh my god. They're just repeating. I'm in a nightmare. This is not a dream. Stanley is as awake right now. As he's ever been in his life. Honestly, this is giving me a headache. Is there an end to this? He would prove that he was in control, that this was a dream. So he closed his eyes gently, and he invited no. himself. No, 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 no. Weight of the blanket oh, on his skin. No, no, the no, no. Press no. Of the mattress on his I leg. feel a restart is about to happen Fresh again, man. The, world outside this one. the only pressure I have is from you. Himself. I'm through with this dream. I wish it to be over. Let me go back to my job. What Let me continue pushing the buttons. Please. No. It's all I want. Let me quit this job. I want my apartment and my wife. I have a wife. And my job. All I want is my life exactly the way it's always been. My life is normal. I am normal. Everything will be fine. I am. Okay. I am not okay. I have voices in my head telling me that okay, I'm still in the in the loop, I guess. Right, yep, yep, I am. Stanley began screaming. Please, someone wake me up. My name is Stanley. I have a boss, I have an office, I am real. Please, just someone tell what, me I am what, real. What is going I must on? Be real. What I is must going be. on? Can anyone hear my voice? Who am I? Who am I? Is everything I? turning red? Am I dying? And everything went black. Okay. This is the story of a woman named Mariella. What the f- Mariella woke up on a day like any other. She arose, got dressed, gathered her belongings, and walked to her place of work. But on this particular day, her walk was interrupted by the body of a man who had stumbled through the This just took a dark and turn. Himself, ...and then collapsed dead on the sidewalk. And although she would soon turn to go call for an ambulance, for just a few brief moments, she considered the strange man. He was obviously crazy. This much she knew. Oh my God, knows that's me, isn't it? Like. And in that moment, she thought to herself how lucky she was to be normal. I am sane. I Fuck am you, Mariella. Of my mind. I know what Judging is me and what isn't. It was comforting to think this, and in a certain way, seeing this man made her feel better. 
Seeing then a dead man made you feel better? For that what kind of sadistic fuck are you? People whose impressions of her would affect her career, and by extension, the rest of her life. She had no time for this, so it was only a moment that she stood there, staring down oh, at the Oh, God. Door. Call somebody. Ran. You ran away from... What, what just happened? I'm restarting again. Okay. 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 Well... You know what? <laughs> like and subscribe. I'm 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 gonna go put ice on my head because this just gave me a headache. Brush our shoulders off They're going stones But we're bigger than a motor